As the Omicron variant becomes the dominant variant in new COVID cases across the country, hospitalizations in the Commonwealth, especially pediatric hospitalizations, are also the highest they've ever been. Dr. Rochelle Walensky, the director for CDC, said experts are still learning more about Omicron and how it impacts children. She urges the public who can get vaccinated to do so to protect children who cannot. The CDC says a study showed that hospitalizations were 11 times higher in boys and girls who were unvaccinated compared to those in the same age group that were vaccinated. Dr. Laura Sass, an infectious disease expert at Norfolk's Children's Hospital of the King's Daughters, says booster approval for children ages 12 and up brings her hope. Just like we boost other vaccines like tetanus and pertussis, Getting booster shots for another respiratory viral illness makes sense. Well, many parents received a mass text from the hospital this week stating that urgent care clinics and emergency rooms were full, encouraging them to seek alternatives to COVID testing.